Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to be making hazelnut s'mores with our Ninja Foodie Flip Toaster. So you ready? Let's get into this. For our ingredients, we have our graham crackers, our marshmallows, and our hazelnut spread. First, we're going to get a little bit of our hazelnut spread onto one side of each of these graham crackers. By the way, if this is your first time here and you want to learn some cool new recipes, get some great cooking tips and tricks and all sorts of other kitchen related things, then start now by subscribing to the channel and clicking the notification bell so you never miss a thing. Next, we want to lay these graham crackers out onto the baking tray. Make sure you leave a tiny bit of space between them just in case the marshmallows expand a little bit. Then you're going to take marshmallows, set it on top of each one of these as so. Then we'll go ahead and slide this into the Ninja Foodie Flip Toaster. Make sure you're set to 400 degrees and set the broil. And then we'll go ahead and start this and set the timer to two minutes. Keep in mind, we're not gonna use this entire two minutes, but that's just so we don't have to restart it. And you're gonna wanna go ahead and let this broil until the tops of your marshmallows are crunchy and just a little bit burned, just like you get with a campfire. Don't worry about opening this up to check. If you open it up, take a look, Close it back again, it'll just kind of continue where it left off. Also keep in mind that if you don't have a Ninja Foodie Flip Toaster, you can use the broiler on your oven, or you can even use your microwave if you have to. Day two. Go ahead and check and see if these are ready. And this is just about the way we want them to look. Nice and charred, but not totally burned either. Finally, to finish these up, all we gotta do is stack them. So you can just take your other tops that we've already put the spread on, and just kind of put them on, spread side down. If you'd like to learn a little bit more about us, you can check out a couple more videos or you can check us out online at joesphenomenal.com. This is a really great recipe and if you're somebody who likes to eat s'mores, it's a great alternative that doesn't have all that sugar. If you want some more info about this recipe, all of the ingredients and measurements are down in the description of the video, along with the calorie count, the fat, the protein, and the carbs. Also, if you want some more information about the Ninja Foodie Flip Toaster, I do have an affiliate link down in the description of the video as well. I thank you so much for taking a little bit of time out of your busy day to watch this video. It really means a lot to me, and I can't wait to see you back again here really soon. So until that time, I'm Joe, and I hope you have a phenomenal day.